Hey guys, it's Metacosis Perfect Snatus, where medicine makes perfect sense. Let's continue our microbiology and infectious diseases playlist. In previous videos, we have talked about Clostridia and Nocardia. Today, let's talk about Rhodococcus, Cordonia, and Tsukamorella. Please remember this because when we later discuss the gram negatives, I'll tell you that in general, if a bacteria ends in Ella, it's probably gram negative rather than gram positive. Do we have exceptions? Of course we do. Tsukamorella is one such exception. It ends in Ella, yet gram positive. Please watch the videos in this playlist in order. Just like Nocardia. The three bacteria that we're discussing today are gram-positive rods and non-spore forming. Of course, you know that if you have medium chain mycolic acid, you will be weakly acid fast, just like nocardia. So please pause and review. What do we mean by acid fast? We mean acid resistant, i.e. resistant to decolorization with a weak acid solution. Do you remember nocardia? Nocardia is aerobic. Nocardia is found in the soil. Nocardia has those hyphae that are up in the air, i.e. aerial hyphae. Nocardia does not stain well with gram. Nocardia is weakly acid fast. So we use an acid fast stain. Let's talk about rhodococcus. First of all, what does rhodo mean? It means rosy or red. Because rhodococcus has pink, red, or mucoid colonies or salmon pink pigment. What does coccus mean? It means spherical. And this is very interesting because here is a rod that can change into a coccus based on whether we're talking about a new culture or an old culture. I know I sounded like Will Durant. Forgive me. Quote, is it new? Nothing is new but arrangement. Close quote. Rudococcus is aerobic, non-spore forming, gram-positive rod, weakly acid fast. Remember, nocardia did not stain well with gram stain, but rudococcus will stain well, giving me a rod, gram-positive rod in the beginning, which will turn into a gram-positive coccus later. Rhodococcus is weakly acid fast. Rhodococcus, like nocardia, is slow growing on media. And rhodo means rose or red. These are my pink red mucoid colonies with salmon pink pigment. The branches are rudimentary, not as robust as the branching filament of nocardia, which were very prominent. Rhodococcus is facultated intracellular organism, which means it can live inside your macrophages just like nocardia. If you're immunocompromised, you are at a higher risk of rhodococcus infection, namely invasive lung disease, lung abscesses, granulomatous infections, etc. But even if you are immunocompetent, you can still get a rhodococcus infection, namely traumatic endophthalmitis, post-traumatic skin infections, and peritonitis, especially if you are a long-term dialysis patient. Treatment of rhodococcus is very difficult, by the way. The medications that doctors use usually include macrolides, fluoroquinolones, and if you're immunocompromised, we add to these vancomycin. Why? It has excellent entry into your macrophages to kill the bacteria that lives inside your macrophages. We're done with the Rhodococcus equi. Let's talk about Godonia and Tsukamorella. Both are aerobic, non-spore forming, gram-positive rods that are weakly acid fast. Godonia can lead to lung infections, skin infections, and catheter-related infections. Tsukamorella causes catheter-related infections. Can we call these nosocomial infections, i.e. hospital-acquired infections? Of course. Where do you think you got the catheter from? from the hospital. In the next video, we'll talk about actinomyces. In the meantime, if you'd like to learn about macrolides, fluoroquinolones, vancomycin, download my antibiotics course on my website medicosisperfectsnatus.com. I also have an autonomic pharmacology course, a leukemia notebook, and much more. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, hit the bell, and click on the join button. You can support me here or here, or by clicking on thanks below this video. You can download my courses at medicosisperfectionaries.com. Look at Picmonic for some doozy medical mnemonics. Thank you for watching. Be safe, stay happy, study hard. This is Medicosis Perfectionalis, where medicine makes perfect sense.